brand new to fans of Flanders is this enlightening new segment, Once Upon a Time. Have you ever heard of the Lange Wappel? A pesky mysterious character whose giant strides can carry him miles and moments. Such a curious name deserves some investigation. Teasing people, tricking them, irritating them. This story is about Lange Wapper, a trickster who did this for a hobby. He could shapeshift into everything and therefore be everywhere without people knowing. He could follow you around if he wanted and suddenly sneak up on you, trick you, scare you and laugh like the devil. <laughs> These narrow streets in Antwerp provided many opportunities for him to hide and to sneak up on your back. You would think twice before being outdoors late in the evening. <laughs> there was one way people could protect themselves from Langawapa. For some reason he couldn't stand the sight of a Holy Mary statue. So the people of Antwerp filled the street corners with Holy Mary statues. And they were so good at it that Lange Wapper one day jumped into the river and killed himself. But what is true about this story? Well, nothing really. It's kind of like a horror story today and had a functional moral meaning. It helped to keep kids inside of the house and for bartenders it was convenient to close up their bar at a more appropriate hour. But hey, he's dead now but maybe kind of still alive. One of Lange Wapper's abilities was he could make himself gigantic to scare the drunks. And so with one single leap, he could step from one city to the next. Maybe this is why the bridge project to close the Antwerp Ring Road is called Lange Wapper. There are not many things the Flemish people have waited longer for than to see the Antwerp Ring Road finished. But the project is caught up in a judicial maze, so the bridge might end up being a legend itself. <laughs>